Hello everybody, this is Rana, a product manager from PHPHR. Welcome to a new video in explaining our effective CRM system. In today's video, we are going to explain in details one new feature from our system. As we mentioned previously that our system is your best tool if you want to do more in less time. If you want to get leads, drive sales, connect with your prospects and grow your business. So in today's video, we are going to move to the third feature, which is customers. How to manage your customers on the system. Customer is simply the one who buys, actually buys your products or services. So if you want to manage customers on the system, you go here and click on customers click on manage customers and simply here you will find first the existing customers here you can simply search any customer by typing the name of the customer here and clicking go you can sort your customers from here newest oldest and so on and you can add new customer by clicking here add new customer you can fill in simply the information about the customer in these boxes here as we saw previously on opportunity and leads as well and you click save and by clicking save you added new customer if we go back here is another way to add customer by clicking on import and you can import an Excel sheet or bulk data sheet including all the details and the information about the customer. You can also export the information from here, export the information about a specific customer in the form of Excel sheet. If we go to the existing customers here, you will find below view details, edit and delete. Delete is simply deleting the customer that will go here to the recycle bin. View details, if you click on view details here, you will find all the details about the customer. First, profile here, then the contacts, any contacts, you can add from here new contacts or you can edit the existing contacts. If you want to add, simply click here and you add the name, the phone and so on and you click save and you have successfully added new contact. You can delete or edit by clicking on edit and you can update or change any information here and you click update. Then we move to calls. It's your calls history. Then we move to calls, which is like your calls history, your calls log. You simply add new call from here. You write the date, the description, the type of the call, and you can choose from incoming, outgoing, and here it's related to what? The call, and you simply click save. Appointments. As we explained previously that we already have a sample text you can use for appointments you can just adjust or customize the uh, text depending on your customer and here are the existing appointments you can edit and you click Save you can also send new one by customizing and adding or updating the information here. 
to send an appointment and you click send to contact. And here in the section of quotations, simply you can find the quotation here. An existing one, you can simply view details of the existing quotation. Also, you can edit the info of the quotation by clicking here on edit and you start to update or change any information about the quotation and then you go back and you can send it to a customer you can download it or you can delete it to go to the recycle pen if you want to add new quotation you simply click here on add new quotation and you start to type in the information about uh, the quotation, the date, the notes, and you move to the section of the item and you start typing in the information of the item. You can also add new item from here. And you simply click save. So if we go back, we will move to the section of invoices. And just like the quotation, you just view, you can view the details of an existing invoice here. You can edit it, you can print it, you can download it as a PDF, you can send it as well. Okay. And if we go back here if you click here also you can edit the invoice you can send it to customer or download it as a PDF file or delete it you can add new one from here you just type in the info about the invoice and the item as well and you click Save it's very simple Next, we find tickets. Tickets are about any issues, problems, or complaints regarding the product or the service. So you simply, if you add, if you want to add new ticket, you just click here on add ticket and you write here in the subject uh, the complaint, the problem or the issue, and then you write the description here and you click save. It's very simple. If you want to attach or to add documents or any files, you simply click on documents or files and you click add from here and you start typing in and you attach the Google Drive URL and so on. And you simply click save. Also, if you add or if you want to manage the expenses of the customer so you simply go ex to expenses and click on add new expense and you start type the category of the expense and details about it here and you can also attach or upload a file uh, including the receipt of the expense and you simply click save If you got any notes, you click on notes and add new note and you simply here write your note and save and you will successfully add new note. And that's it. So it's very simple to manage your customers on our CRM system because it's very easy and simple. It's systematic thank you so much and wait for our next video explaining a new feature from our crm system bye bye